。今天给大家介绍一款情侣拖鞋，鞋身立体，鱼形图案绘制，采用优质面料。How many words was crime and punishment? I'm unwanted, unloved, disowned, and the doctor says I'm dying of cancer. I'm a complete failure. I just looked at the live again, and I'm actually quite happy with it. The cat didn't move. This cat had been put to bed. <laughs> For what was a very <laughs> dense narrative, you managed to whittle into something quite cool. <laughs> Oh wow! Two hundred eleven thousand five hundred ninety-one words. Quarter of a million. Fuck! The road snapped at him. No, he was being stupid. Such an unusual upset. He found what he was looking for inside. Dash darkness. <laughs> <laughs> How long's the metamorphosis? Eleven thousand. Your character is angsting. It seems that his dog just died in a freak accident. The accident involved his kindly uncle, who didn't swerve in time to avoid the poor puppy. However, he did swerve in time to go off an embankment and hit a bull, hit a bus full of high school students, killing many, including the character's beloved girlfriend, to, to whom he'd just been engaged the previous day. Unfortunately, the shock of the news caused the protagonist's kindly old mother to have a heart attack. Which left his father devastated. <laughs> Shoes, body light wear design, easy to wear. Has material design. Has good <laughs> softness. <laughs> I think I prefer this to the original. <laughs> Boy who lived. <laughs> More unfortunately, economic recession hits, and the character <laughs> and his father are left without a job and sunk neck deep in debt. The character's brother turns to robbery, but he's caught and thrown in prison. She should have killed like all of her darlings. <laughs> Made a different story. Poor Daddy turned to drinking and lost all will to live, and finally shot himself, <laughs> leaving the character oh, all alone. Several others in a mass shootout, <laughs> leaving the characters all, all alone in the world to deal with the trauma. Fish feet, nothing more, nothing less. If you don't turn up to suck my dick wearing these, <laughs> and that just happens to be the day. When the mother of all earthquakes lays waste to the whole city, including the character's house, our character, who now has to live on the streets, is pulled out of the ruins, perhaps having suffered a crippling injury, and is taken to the hospital where the doctor diagnoses him with cancer. Boy, what a day! <laughs> <laughs> the way that TV tropes is written feels like how an MCU fan speaks. I am Anna. I was the wife of Jesus, Ben Joseph of Nazareth. I called him beloved, and he, laughing, called me Little Thunder. <laughs> <laughs> Ha 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 ha! More, more. Little Thunder sounds like some hokey name from a Hollywood western in the fifties, where white people in dark makeup played Native Americans. <laughs> Little Thunder. <laughs> Oh, shit, that's good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Very good. A flopper blanket probably saved a lot of relationships. To be honest.
Pain. pain. Whispering voices. Pain. 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 Need pay. P. New pain. What are they sticking in me? Sleep. Pain. Whispering voices. As you know, Nurse Eastman, the government spooks controlling this hospital will not permit me to give this patient the care I feel you can love flowers for Algernon. God. So good. I am the horse. Bruce didn't care about treatments, he cared about pain. <laughs> he cared about that voice because when he heard the voice, the pain went away just for a few seconds. Like, how? Why am I the horse? Now go run some guys at Al. But I'm just. You've just left me here! <laughs> ah. Yeah, go run someone over. Ah. Ah. Yes, Dr. Nance said the sexy voice. A, dock, a door closed and Bruce heard breathing and smelled the enticing smell of shampoo and perfume. <laughs> it was Chanel number five. <laughs> oh, <laughs> let's, get, let's get out of here. <laughs> this is an amazing glitch. All he saw was the roundest, firmest pair of tittles he had ever seen in his life. <laughs> All he closed in a crisp white nurse's uniform. He said, no, he tried to say, but his voice wouldn't work, his mouth was dry, and there was some terrible tube thing in his nose. And hey, what's this thing in his dick? It hurts. <laughs> Bruce wanted to feel those titties. That was what he wanted. <laughs> Not that he could do much else, he realised. Everything hurt, right down to that thing. Whatever it was, in his dick. <laughs> While outside the door, Nurse Eastman leaned against the wall, her breasts rising and falling with passion <laughs> as she tried to control her gasps. Oh no, she thought. 